Boom. Perfect timing with the music and everything. How's everyone doing? We made it through the week. We survived. Um, and now? Now. Saturday. In the park. Not the 4th of July. In a couple months it will be. Um, <laughs> Roscoe's in chat. The boys in chat. Um, we're going to play some more Romero mod today for a few hours. Um, can't do a super long stream today because if y'all want to hop on the discord, um, we are setting up taters is we're setting up a test game of project Zomboid multiplayer. Uh, and taters is going to be hosting this kind of first test thing. If we have too many people that want to play, uh, then we'll just spring for like a hosted server somewhere and we'll pay for it. And, and it'll be a fun thing that the discord community can play together. So, I think currently it's Taters and I, Jive, and Boy with a Joint. So, if anyone else wants to join us, we're going to be trying that out later today in just a few hours. Once I uh, end stream, we're hopefully going to kick it in Project Zomboid. But for now, <clears throat> we're in the fuck hut. And uh, y'all know what that means. We need to actually build the fuck hut. <laughs> we're, we're in the we're in the fuck fence right now, the fuck perimeter. Um, we need. I'm cooking up some paint. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Terrific. Uh, we've been. I need to like get some more mining done. We need to get the the moat around the base done. Uh, I looked into the files. You should play Little Witch in the Woods. Let me know how it is. Um, I looked around in the files and I couldn't determine how to set when the big horde happens. I don't know if it's random or if it's like assigned to a certain day. We got ours on day 10. Um, and I, even in the settings, I tried to make it so that it would happen more often, but you can't do that. It's not like a setting that you can change in the world settings. Um, there's probably something I could find in the files if I knew more about how they were organized. Um, so if anyone has any ideas on how to increase the frequency of Horde Knights in the Romero mod, I'm all ears. But, um, yeah. We we survived our last, our first, hopefully not last Horde Knight, last stream. Uh, I have since bumped the zombies block damage all the way up. So they're now doing full 100% block damage. Uh, because we just had wood and they didn't get anywhere near it. It's because they move, they shamble so slowly, we're able to pick them off uh, a lot faster. So, I want to up my game. I want to make it more dangerous. Uh, and the best way to do that is to increase block damage, because we're already on the highest difficulty. And there are only so many zombies my computer can handle at one given time. Um, I'm streaming out at 720 today in the hopes that uh, it'll be a little better performance-wise. Because streaming at 1080 is nice and all, but... Uh, if your computer can't keep up, then it's kind of pointless. So, doing a 720 stream just to see how we fare. Uh, we need to dig this trench. Oh, it takes three hits to do that. Um, we could probably make a better... Yeah, we can make a tier four shovel. We could just make an iron shovel and say, screw it. Let's do that. We need more leather and more duct tape. How much iron do we have? A little bit in here. We're low on that, too. We really just need to go mining. Yeah, we don't have enough iron. Hamana, hamana, hamana. Let's get a little bit more of this clay going in the forge. Uh, let's go mining so we can get better tools so that we can mine even better. Uh, let's look around us. There's a triple iron node, like, right over there. So we'll go check that out. I don't have the thing that gives me extra stuff, extra mining. Uh, no, I don't get extra mining while, or extra resources while buzzed on coffee. I do not have that book yet. Here they are. Here's the triple iron node. We'll just get a little bit of this, just so we can get that shovel crafted. Hmm. 
All right. I would like to have one more point in. Uh, oh, we do have... We could do one more point. Yeah, there we go. That way we'll make a tier 5. Uh, and then I'll also get a tier 5 iron pick going as well. Off of the uh, iron that we get here. So now that I've destroyed those nodes, is it still on the map? Yes. Okay, good. I could just make a... Make a waypoint, but... Eh. And there's another one right there. So we'll get just kind of these first few pieces of each one and that'll be enough iron for us to smelt up and get some more forged iron running and get these tools made getting a little bit of bonus stone while we do this too which is always nice because we need to make concrete relatively quickly. As long as we can get everything up to cobblestone for the next horde night and like have our have our moat and all this other stuff around the fuck fence, then uh, I think we'll be we'll be pretty solid. All right, that's how much iron. We have 2800. Yeah. That's enough for now. We're kind of on the like the calm after the storm because we had that big horde night so we're getting like no zombie spawns for a little bit the game is nice and and gives you a little bit of of a reprieve after horde nights so let's take advantage of that uh, move you down and put you in terrific All right, we got our paint. We're gonna have to repaint a lot of this stuff once we upgrade to concrete. So I don't want to do any more painting. I was just trying to get like the, trying to get the look nailed down. Um, how are we doing on like, we have five duct tape. We're gonna need more than five duct tape. So let's grab our glue, our bones, and our murky water and make the rest of our glue. Good. So now if we want to make a shovel, a tier 5, okay, we need 6 duct tape and a iron pickaxe, another 6 duct tape. Okay. We will have that um, in a little bit. 1,200 stone. We don't have any. We do have a little bit of that. Let's do like 500 more. And, you know, we should get an extra forge going is what we should do for stone. And take three of our duct tape and pipes. We got them. Got that in our inventory. Good. Um, all right, and as we cook this up, there we go, get a bunch of that rolling. How long is that going to take? Eight minutes. All right, we're good, we're good. We have stuff to sell. We have a little bit of stuff to sell. I'd like to save this scrap chest armor for if we have mods to put on it. So we'll hold on to that. Sell it for more later. All right, there we go. Get the rest of this duct tape made. All right, and I'm just gonna put this over here for now. Yeah. Take like half of these. Those will cook up. 
All right, leather, duct tape, forged iron. Almost there. Oh, I want an iron shovel. <clears throat> 48 forged iron. Good lord. Greedy. All right, we take that off. We'll actually sell that. With 118, that's not terrible. All right. Uh, we have some cobblestone. We can do a little bit of upgrading while we're waiting. Around the base. good oh did we just get a big spawn is hitching. I have enough for two more. There we go. Alright, we probably just got a bunch of enemies spawned in. Alright, and let's get that iron shovel crafted. And then... Is it the same amount for a pickaxe? That's 64 giant for a pickaxe. Good lord. Okay, uh, we got the rest of those going, which is good. It hitched as if, oh uh, yeah, okay, there are a couple, a couple weirdos walking around. We can kill them for some XP while we're waiting on the iron. We have this baseball bat now. Hey, Deb, how are you doing? How have you been? Boom. All right, I got more crawlers. And we got big boy. Look at them all spawning in. Oh, I'm swinging too low. There go. Nope. Ah, fuck. All right, headshots only. Good. Baseball bat's like a little faster. So uh, we were not gonna run into that problem of us sprinting at them and them hitting us before we hit them as much. Your in-laws just left. Well, do you like your in-laws? Because <laughs> either you're doing worse or better now that now that they're not there anymore. <laughs> I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Been doing a okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, we need 60. I need more zombies to kill while I wait. Hello? Nobody. Better. <laughs> they're fine, just they're in-laws. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, your in-laws are huge fans of my channel, and they're in chat right now. Jerry, Jerry. Oh boy. Let's see. Really, that was like the only, those are the only spawns we got. Like those 10 dudes. All right. Oh, we're at 60 now. All right, let's get this pickaxe going. Craft it. Just in time to get the shovel. 
Perfecto. And we'll pop that on there. Fantastic. Okay, now... Oh, yeah, now we two hit. It was all worth it. All worth it. <sighs> now, I know... I'm trying to think of, like, what type of block I want around the base before we, like, angle down into the pit. It's not really going to be much of a pit. It's more of, like, a decline and then a, a gradual incline. Um, you know, maybe, maybe we model that out front here, just so we kind of all know what we're working with. All right. We'll dig this section out, and then we'll play around with some blocks. Uh, which means we're going to need more frame shapes. All right. It's just so slow. <laughs> uh. I've, um, I mean, obviously, I streamed it on Thursday, but I've been playing a lot of Satisfactory, and so, ooh, hello, uh, and so I'm used to being able to do things very quickly, uh, and so going back to this is like, ugh, I'm like dragging my feet, um, let's go mother load, so we get some more resources while we mine. In the center here, we'll have a little, we'll have a bridge. We're not going to do a drawbridge. I don't want to get super technical with it. Um, well, I don't know. Well, we could do a drawbridge. We could. I just feel like every time you do a drawbridge, the zombies inevitably end up destroying it. And it's, like, such a pain to place. Animal Crossing after start is a <laughs> That's a good point. Ah, uh, hey, go enjoy the party. Have a fantastic time. I'll see you later. All right. I'm thinking we do something like this. So there's a little bit of that ledge. And then we're steadily going downwards. And then we need... We need this, like this little bit of it. Is it you? No, you're rounded. I need like a smaller wedge. It's like this, but half the depth. Like you? No. Not quite. Very close, though. You? Ramp tip? I don't want an offset, though. Can we get it to go the way we want? Probably not. Yeah, we need the ramp tip that's not offset. Doesn't exist. Doesn't exist. Um, I hope I didn't miss it. What's up, boy with the joint? How you doing? How you doing? You excited to play some Zomboid in a bit? I am, I'm very excited to play Zomboid. There's got to be, like, the perfect piece. Look how many pieces there are. Son of a gun. Look at all these pieces. So we did cube, corner, beveled. We need... We need the replacement for what hath been beveled. I mean, it has to exist, right? What about you? What about you? It's round. No. Uh, 
Um, this isn't. No, it's also rounded. Man, what? Uh, what in the world? Let's just go into the wedge category. Because it's like this, but not that. Because if we were to do this, I mean, sure, that gets us there, but it's not the same angle. You know what I'm saying? It just ain't right. Hmm. Then maybe we use a different block? Maybe we go with like the wedge 60. There we go. Playing some GTA 5 RP. Very nice. What are you RPing as? <laughs> Very cool. So you're role playing as a hero, a true hero. Oh man, what if you were an Amazon employee who would go onto a GTA 5 role-playing server to role-play as an Amazon employee? You're just like doubling down on what you do as a real job? I mean, there's gotta be people who do that, right? Like in like Second Life? There's gotta be people who in Second Life just are what they are in real life. And so like here they have a chance to literally be anything they could possibly imagine. And they just remake their current life again. That's got to be true happiness, right? Maybe that's the secret. Maybe therein lies true happiness. If you can... <laughs> if you can tolerate living your life twice... Then I think you've got it made. Um, let's do you. And then we need to find a 60 degree wedge. Right? No, we need to find the topper for that and then that will go below that. Oh, it's the best work. You get 5,000 bucks for each package you deliver? Hell yeah. Nice. Very nice. I support this. I respect the hustle. I mean, the, zomb the zombies can get up this, right? Ugh. I feel like they'll end up jumping up this. It's, is it too steep? Is that too much? Fuck. I mean, the other option, and this is way more boring. The other option is just... No, uh, out here. We just do straight 45s. That's so boring, though. <laughs> Oops. 
I hate it when I misclick in real life. Oh man, I can already tell this is going to be a lot of digging to get this thing done. Also, did we get some spawns? Oh, we did. It's a wandering horde! Hell yeah, let's fucking go. What's up, loser? Come here, folks. You all have XP, and I want it. There we go. Eh, okay, a little bit of ammo. Oh, this is wonderful. Break that down. Shit, that's a dog. Okay, you know what? Okay. There's another dog over there. There we go. Tremendous work. There we go. Oh. Uh, misclick in real life. I'm just joking. Because, uh... Because you're on an RP server. Oh! There we go. Alright, let's uh, harvest these. I'm thirsty. Good thing I pulled some red tea out of that guy's butt. dog out there and a chicken Fuck. oh sh that didn't kill the chicken that chicken's amazing okay well kill this dog hey what's up I'm hungry? Good lord. This body just ain't cutting it. Alright. Well, hey, that was eventful. If I could have one of those, like, every ten minutes, that'd be great. Alright, let's get the rest of this put away. Good. All right, and we got our brand new pickaxe, so let's repair that one and get it ready to sell. Um, yeah, we'll drink another red tea. those in the tier five fantastic sell you and we need some stuff to eat um oh we have bacon and eggs in our inventory duh you know what? let's just use all our eggs i don't care i know you can make good stuff with them later but i need food now and at 30 perfect Okay, we now have some spare forged iron. Not a lot, but some. Um, while that's cooking, let's... Yeah, get the rest of that sorted out. Um, this guy. Let's do... Let's do that. Okay. 
Back to digging. Digging is thirsty work. Makes us hungry and thirsty. Okay, we are very slowly leveling up while we dig, though. All right, now we go down. Maybe here we adjust the angle to be shallower. Ah, it's not far enough down. We'll go down one more and then we'll adjust the angle. This is going to be a tremendous amount of digging. We're not going to want to like really do this until we have like an auger. Or until we're like one-shotting this stuff. Which would probably be with a steel shovel, would be my guess. Um, yeah, so we'll do one more down. Good. And then we will make the angle shallow over the next couple blocks, and then we'll flatten it out and then go back up on the other side. test I want to test the steeper angles oops so it was wedge 60 There we go. Good lord. We'll get one of these guys' attention. And then we need a steeper one. The wedge 60 tip. Test this to see if he can make it up here. Hey, pizza. Pizza, pizza. Over here. Come on down. See if I can lure him up here. No, he's going to go in my base. Now he's down here go up here and they cannot get to me okay so that's not gonna work 
We'll have to go the... Ooh, nice. We'll have to go the 45 route. Okay. You can repair that and sell it. Well, answers that question. Uh, here. Right, and then do we have a 30? No. What, um... What would work for that? If we want to do a shallower, it would be this. We'd do the wedge 60, but... Do it like this. Yeah, that's... Yep, and then we want the wedge 60 tip. But like this. Yeah, like that. I'm not confident in how we're going to do with the corners, but we can probably figure something out. Let's take care of these stragglers. Maybe we'll level up. Darlene? Oh, you're feral. Thanks for the XP. Arlene? Also feral. Thanks for the level. Got a nurse out there. All right, let's level. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Iron gut. Let's put at least one point into that. It just makes things a little bit easier. Okay. Uh, the fastest way to do this will be to dig down to where we need to be. Dig out the perimeter, and then dig out underneath, and then collapse it. We'll do that all the way down the line. should still get plenty of uh, plenty of clay while doing that. This is all stone now, so when we dig down for the final layer, we'll have to dig through stone, which is fine. Alright, we go back to our normal blocks. This is one, two, three... Four blocks down. Okay. Yeah, that's low enough to do like a thin bridge. Yeah. Alright, my dog is losing his shit outside right now. Um... Um, in terms of resources, how are we doing? We got our 139 stone out of there. Bunch of forged iron. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Uh, 
Okay. Yeah, so we'll dig four blocks down, and then we have one... Two. And then this again. So it'll be... One, two, three, four, five, six more. That's the six. Okay. Ooh. That's big. Cool, though. And I'll dig this all the way down to the end. Because this is the path we're going to follow. Is we'll have to dig down the four and then cut out everything that's underneath it in the middle. Uh, and then it'll collapse. Saving us a lot of time. there. Yep. And we are going to have to do this on all four sides. Very cool. Once we get the auger, this will not take that much time. I'm just going to focus on doing one side at a time, and then we'll add in the corners as we need them. Because I don't know quite how long this will take. Probably a long time. All right, there we go. That is our ring. So let's get that stuff stored away, get that put away. And let's go do some quests, because we need to get some XP rolling. How much clay we got in there? Okay. Yeah, all right. So we gotta go to that army camp. Well, let's go do that. Another dog over here, are you kidding me? Get out of here, dude. And watch out for landmines. I think this one primarily has landmines, yeah, in the dirt around it and then in the trench. Maybe not even in the trench. Okay. He did. Ah, okay, the quest start is on the other side. Well, might wake some people up with this, but we'll see. A wolf. Nailed it. Cool. Hey, people. Oh, there we go. Oh. Didn't see him there. It's close. You just stay sleeping there, my guy. And you too. Good. Okay.
Alrighty. Hang on. Hang on. Ooh. There we go. Sir. Okay. Uh, trash. Nice. A couple springs in there. Um, is there anything else, really? I mean, in here, we can just go ahead and clear this place out. I don't mind doing this one twice. It's pretty short. Go down. Um, ooh, customize fittings mod. There we go. All right, some medical supplies in here. Not terrible. Good stuff to have. Ooh, a cast. That's pretty good. Ah, okay. Well, a couple things we can sell. And over here. Ooh, an engine. Nice. And there's a backpack here. Damn. Uh. Uh, all right, I will eat that and the pears. And that's all there is to it. Pretty quick one. Drop this stuff off at the bike. Oh. They're all waiting. Shame we didn't find like a... Grenade or anything. Let's go take care of them before we activate that uh, quest. Hey folks! <laughs> the hell's turn around. Woo! Okay. That's a lot of dogs. Damn. Fucking dogs. Jesus. Oh my God. Ooh, double kill with that. That was neat. There's another level. Nice, another double kill. Man, I like the baseball bat. Uh, let's go use this bandage that we put in here. We'll put the blood bag away. Okay. We're good. Now we can uh, run through the POI again. I might get all these body bags. I don't know. I don't think it's worth it. All right, let's get the people around the edge first. I use the word people lightly. Oh, oh God, he's feral. Did not realize he was feral. Fun folks in here. Feral one. Oh, God. Hi. Nice. Okay. Uh, repair that. Hmm. 
Oh, it's ferals. Did I not go up here before? There's this weapons bag here. I guess I missed that. Uh, I don't have any pipes, but uh, Iron Breaker mod we do not have yet. Nice. Very good. Let's eat that real quick. Another engine. Okay. Damn. Almost had him. Uh, ooh, level four football helmet. That's better than our mining helmet, right? Stats-wise? No, the mining helmet is better. No, what? Wait, what? Who? Mining helmet stats to football helmet. Football helmet to mining helmet. Weird. Okay. Well, let's pop that off. Pop that on. And pop that on. Awesome. Uh, we'll take that off. I'm actually just going to scrap that level one. Okay. College jacket increases our run speed. Let's swap that over. That is always the best item. Okay. Not a bad amount of stuff here. Cool. Uh, let's just use these. Cornmeal, sure. Um, all right, more stuff to sell. Take it. Pair that. Take that. Let's drop off at the bike real quick. Alrighty. Okay. Okay. Hey, a pipe. Repair. Welcome back, my man. They tried to kill you. It wasn't for pulling that knife out. Mechanic, was it? Like, hey, we, we are... Oh. Someone's dead. We heard you was bothering my cousin Mikey at his garage. Oh, I forgot to get the... I just said, let's grab the supplies, and I forgot it already. I'm an idiot. A big, stupid idiot. Emphasis on the big. And stupid and idiot. Emphasis on everything. Um, alright, put all that away. Good. That stuff's gone. Keep three of those on us. 
It's probably fine. All right, stuff we're going to sell. Maybe we'll just sell that mod. I don't want to hold on to it. Um, okay. Good. Automotive stuff. And let's get the rest of the stuff in the bike. And we'll then we'll grab a different job, because I'm stupid. Oh boy. Selling all that. Couple medical things and some gas. Okay. Not bad, not bad. I thought I had Did I get two engines? I guess I just got the one. All right. What's the trader got for us? Also, I have a level. Um I was going into this. Yeah, I need more intelligence levels for... Yeah. We'll save up for those. Better... Um, better quest rewards. Uh, Yeah, we should get Rockbusters. Yeah. A nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. Alright, anything close by? 321 fetch. Gig. Well... I'll be goddamn. Alrighty Here's then. Doc, on your day way. 13. Anything that I require? Was there something else? I drink both of these. Okay. Let's do the quest. All right. Uh, I think if we finish tier three quests, we get a mini bike. So I'll just hold off crafting one until we get the mini bike. And then maybe we'll be able to just like buy a motorcycle at some point. What's up, Mo? Oops. Broke a fence with my bike. Powerful legs. Alright, let's real quick search. We've searched all these mailboxes. Oh, yeah. Thomas. Apparently, I've been here. Oh, well. Um, yes, we have searched that. So, let's real quick reset. And let's not leave without... <laughs> <laughs> the supplies this time. Wake up. Hello? Anyone? Where is everybody? Aha! I knew it. Can't eat that miso soup. Ooh, I'll take that jack-o'-lantern. That'll look good in the fuck hut. Okay. What's up, dude? So we can go down to the basement. That's locked. Let's go upstairs first. Ow. Sir. Ma'am. Jesus. Right. 
Get the wrench out. else okay nice a little bit of pairs Ooh, a few more lock picks I think we have enough lock picks now that I'm willing to try the gun safe at the trader plus we're a little higher level now more game stage nice oh fuck sir Shit. Oh! Come on. Can't hit his damn head. There we go. Jesus. Uh, we'll sell that. I don't use stun batons. Um, I don't need the chrysanthemums. Uh-huh. Okay. Back in here. Get the rest of that stuff. Okay. Not bad. All right, now to the basement. Oh, well, maybe hit the bike and then the basement. Uh, let's drop that one extra bone. Yeah, okay. Besamonte. What's up? Oh my god. Alright. Oh lord, they're coming. Woo! Sir? Ma'am? Crowd control. Sir? Oh, that didn't kill him. Okay. Woo! Anything good in here? No. Oops. Oh my god, switch. Okay. Hey, there we go. Some more die. More die. to wolves and an ergonomic grip mod hey -o. that's good um ergonomic grip we already have one on our club our baseball bat probably on probably on our iron pickaxe and then put that on our wrench yes okay we got that Ooh, gold nugget. Hello. Chicken ration. And a red tea. All right. And metal chain mod. Eh, okay. Uh, we can take this apart. 
Some more forged iron this way. Alright. Get the rest of this place looted up and peace out. Two more lockpicks, nice. Okay. Lots of little things to loot in here. And a lot of food. Well, alright then. Open her on up. Let me out. Nice. An egg for the road. Okay, someone's inside the house. Don't care about that. Is there a bird's nest up there? Oh, I thought I was going to get lucky, get double egg. Nice. Poncho will sell. Here we go. And a purse. Tons of stuff to loot here. Alright. Let's giddy up. Nice. We got our football helmet. We look pretty cool. Alrighty. Sir. Sirs. Just duck and weave. Alrighty. It's going to be a real bummer if this trader ever dies. How lucky we're going to get with this. Tier 3 pistol. Hell yes. Thank you, sir. Um, I think that's it for me for today. We will swap out these pistols. Actually, let me sell a couple things. Okay. Luck with that. Let's modify you. And then we scrap that into parts because the parts are more valuable. Boom. Very good. Yeah, don't need any of that stuff. Alright, we got a nice little chunk of change for doing that job. All in all, that's a win. stuff. Ah, okay. Ugh. 
All right, more stuff to sell. Okay. And some pistol parts. Alright. This jack-o'-lantern. Hmm. Find a spot for that. Yeah, we do have eight lockpicks now. We also have a jailbreaker. So we could guarantee us... Away into that safe. Probably eat some eye candy before doing that. And I'd like to also identify where some other safes are. We can like run a gauntlet. All right. Well, nothing to it, uh, but to do it. Level wise, we have two points. So we can buy that tier. And then next level will be Daring Adventurer. Got to make some progress on this front section at least. Thought I heard something. Oh. Someone smacked something. Hello? It's a rabbit. Oh, come on. I had his ass. I had your ass. Damn it. I had him. I had him. Oh. Well, oh, got some friends here, though. It would be funny to get like a wandering horde and lure them all in here and just have them dig it out for me. <laughs> just stand in the middle and let them dig. That'd be pretty good. All right, we're getting there.
Ooh, almost at the end of this long stretch. so close. Couple more, then we cut to the right and join back up. Okay, good lord. Keep moving. Oh, duh. hang on. Okay, I can't stop moving. <laughs> I can't stop moving. Oh, come on. Just let a let a brother dig. Okay. Just gotta kind of like I just gotta get a little bit of a groove on. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's a weird one. I don't think I've seen that one before. <laughs> Gotta keep moving. Oh, reach! Yeah, every last thing must be a challenge. There we go. 
All right. Yeah, let's get around. Oh, taters. This is so much slower than satisfactory. Oh, I chihuahua. There we go. That was part of it. Part of it is now done. Good for us. Let's clean that up. Yeah. Oh, the the art. Oh, I think they just took. I think they just took sprites from the actual games. Is what it seems like. But it, it's very like um, we're talking about. Uh, what's the name of it? Uh, the, the Pokemon Crystal League is on itch.io right now. Uh, so download it before it gets taken down, because <laughs> it probably will. Um, but it's like. It's like a Pokemon trading card game meets the structure of Inscription and the mechanics of Inscription, even. Like, the cards have attack and defense and health, and it's like a sliding scale. Like, in order to win, each trainer has to do a certain number of damage to the other trainer. But, like, if I do three damage to you, like, we, we both start at five. I do three damage to you. I now have eight, and you only have two. You do four damage to me. You have six. Now I only have like three or four, whatever that, whatever that would be. Um, so it's like uh, kind of a back and forth a little bit. Pocket Crystal League, that's what it is. Thank you. Pocket Crystal League. It looks really interesting. And then it's it's uh, I don't know if it's supposed to be like a roguelike or whatever, but like you pick a starter deck, um, and you're picking which Pokemon that you're gonna play. In order to like, in order to lay certain Pokemon, you need to have berries on the field first that they like. So you have to like balance what kinds of Pokemon you're gonna have uh, versus like what berry cards you have in your deck. It's got that kind of stuff. Looks interesting. So you think you're gonna stream that, Tades? A oh, Crystal Rom hack. Okay. What's the dealio with that? Nailed it. You should know it's a big overhaul? Okay. It seems like you've really done your research. Also, are you going to be good to start up Zomboid at 3 o'clock? Is you or isn't you going to be good? You want to be surprised? That's fair. You, know, you have to leave around 3.30. Oh, that's poopy. There we go. All right. Now we just have this one chunk. So let's uh, let's start digging. And then we gotta place a lot of blocks, which means we're gonna have to go get more wood. <laughs> That's the way it goes. Ah. Uh, that makes a lot of sense. It's a good excuse.
Maybe we should just dig one deep around the whole ring. Ah, shit. Feral. Jesus. Maybe we should dig one ring around the whole thing. Um, and then make it collapse, like, all at once. I feel like cleanup will be less that way. Just a couple in on each side, and then once we dig the middle out, more of it will collapse. We're going to have a lot of clay after this is over. More than we will ever need. Jesus. Turns out clay soil doesn't uh, have a whole lot of strength behind it. Funnily enough. Oh, we're so close. I am I am dying inside. Having to do this, and it's so slow. I might level up again though. have to move fast right now. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, you suck. I can still reach. I can still reach. Reach. Ah. Uh. 
God damn it. Okay. Okay. Any second now. There we go. Takes a million years. Oh, we're close. We're very close. There we go. All right, we did it. Now we just clear it out. Then we can really get started building. Oh boy. Dawn of the 13th day. So close to leveling. Yes, there we go. Alright. Uh, we can buy Daring Adventure 3. We need Intellect 8 to get the last one. But we have three additional choices for rewards, and we get more Dukes. It's a good deal. Oh, come on. Is that it? Nope. There we go. Oh, hey, look. A friend has come to pay a visit. I'm crouched. That's part of why I'm moving so slowly. Okay. Good lord. Whip me up another 50 of those hot pieces. Go. And let's get these going. And there we go. 
That's what it'll be. Cool little half pipe. You like it? There we go. So zombies will come down. That'll enable me to get a decent chance at a headshot on them. Ma'am. Die! Okay. Got some more folks wandering in. So it'll be this great big half pipe, effectively. And then um, we'll actually take this row out. Yeah, we'll take that row out and then it'll be a bridge across, which we'll go ahead and make. Uh, let's get another 50 of those rolling. Um, and this bridge... Hmm. Feel like it should... Okay, let's go ahead and eat real quick. There we go. Um, do I like that beam coming across? I think so, yes. Let's grab the hammer. Whoop. should be solid blocks. Okay. And we will upgrade them. Copy that shape. It is definitely maxed out, though. Let's try that <laughs> again. Oh, we have enough wood. now until those get upgraded further oh 
I'm just gonna temporarily place those there. Oh gosh, give me like another 25 of those. We need this thickness, which I believe is the half block. Nice. Okay. Okay. Now, oh, hi. Hey, folks. Y'all looking for me? I'm just building my base. a nice little group. Ooh, a little four pipe machine gun. Hello. How do you compare? You just straight up do more damage. Okay. Fantastic. Oh, that's a doggy, doggy poo. There we go. Grab these chrysanthemums. I want to make some more red tea. All right. Get some more wood. these trees okay I'm sorry, you did what? Degrade? Did that just lower the durability on every single thing on my fucking tool belt? Excuse me, sir? I think it lowered all of the durability. I mean, certainly my shovel wasn't broken. And it is now. Excuse me, sir? That is mean-spirited. You turd. You just scaring me? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Making me use my repair kits. Uh, let's do a hundred more of those. Um, and let's replant. Nice. All right. We'll 
grab these trees as well. <sighs> it's so scary when the game tells you to expect the scare. Well, it pops up after the noise plays. So the noise plays, and then like several seconds later it pops up. Okay. I think that'll be a good look. The half pipe look. Sure. All right, let's, um... Is this what I want, or do I want a drawbridge? How much does it cost to make a drawbridge? 100 forged iron, 1,000 wood, 20 springs, 30 mechanical. Let's make it. It would look pretty cool. All right, we have 10 waters. Let's make all of those into red tea. Uh, replace that. Oh, egg. Um, let's get you repaired and you repaired. Switch our mods over. Okay. Put the hammer back and put... that in there um, let's get some more that smelted all right it's a new day new quests let's do some eh He also has a new inventory. And there's a new thing in here. Let's buy a red tea for the road. A nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. It's your inventory now, bud. Level 3 military boots. Ooh, I want those. I must have those. Those are good. And a nail gun. Okay, I really need the nail gun the most. I knew you didn't have money uh, the jobs? moment I laid eyes on you. There's this complicated. There's a closer yeah, one. 251. A the farm? Okay. If you're lucky. Let's do this quest. Let's trade him some stuff. And let's get those boots and the nail gun. That's our plan. Oh, the nail gun is going to speed this up so much. Oh, that would be great to get. Oh, it's the bee farm again. Okay. We're going to speed run this bad boy. Is this empty? Yeah. Okay. Pop. Mailbox. Learn it. No cash register? Okay. In we go.
Okay. Oh god. That works. Alright, we're not doing any scrapping, we're only doing loot. Ooh, tier 5 legs. Better than mine. Winter. Man, give me the double pocket one. That one's really good. Okay. go Thomas What's up folks All right, I'm going to need the wood anyways. Guess we'll break these down. Get a little bit of honey. Got a couple of them. Alright, come on, folks. Wake up. Shit. Ow. tough jump especially when the frame rate is dying so we must have a must have a horde nearby oh yeah there we go come on get your ass in there get in there okay Drop. I don't think we ever picked up the last drop that happened. Ooh, sham chowder. Very nice. Let's use these. Chicken ration cell. Burst mod. Meh. All right, take it all and get out. And get out. Oh, no, no, over and covered. All right, out of here. All right, sure. Okay, back to the trader. All right, let's mark that. Right there, right on the road too. We have three drops we haven't been to. We should go get those. It'd be kind of a pain to go get them on the bike, but it's what we got. Hiccups.
All right. What do you have for me? I don't care what folks say about you in the wasteland. You're almost... Take the shotgun shells, I guess. Here we go. Ranged mods. Scrap armor, cloth armor, melee mods, or food. Let's go ranged mods. We're a little low on those. Special jobs, a new trade route. Okay, and you got another clear zombies 300 meters. Nothing else. You best be on your way. All right. Those damn things are selling uh, like hotcake. Open that. Ooh, cripple a mod and the reflex mod. Well, we can switch this out for the reflex, which is good. Cripple them is good to put on the shotgun. And I think that's all we can really do at the moment. Yeah. All right, let's reload while we go. All right, we'll drop off. I would like to get Eh, I don't ever want to use the burst mod. Um, Alright, let's do ammo-related stuff. Just go ahead and eat that. And drink that. Keep that on us, because we'll eat it in a bit. Coffee, good. Cool. All right, and away we go. I feel like we should. We're at 5,700 casino tokens. I feel like we should hit all these drops up. There's one right to the east. Let's go east, north, clear, drop, turn it in. I hope I haven't already gotten this drop. I may have, and then forgotten to clear the thing. That would suck. I think we did. I think we've gotten this. Because we were over here last stream, I think. Yeah, I think we got it already. Yeah, it would be like right there. Yep, we already got that one. So this one we'll remove. Bummer. Alright, well, we'll sweep north. We'll hit up this drop, do the quest. And then maybe we'll head south and get that one. Be able to get tier three quests from that trader starting tomorrow, which is good. Even better rewards. And we're working our way up to being able to select two rewards, which is a big deal. You get better rewards, more choices, and you get to pick two. All very good. Oh. Getting there. Man, drop it a little closer, why don't you? Don't you guys know I only have a bike? There it is.
right. A book bundle. Hey. Oh, uh, Spear Hunter. Okay, Night Stalker. Sure. Okay. Those books sucked. But. Book bundle and a little bit of food. Not bad. Let's remember to remove that drop. Alright, tier 2 clear. And then depending on our inventory, we either will or won't go for that drop real quick. Down south. I've never gotten a book bundle in a drop before. I feel like that's kind of rare. Alright, this is kind of a big house. It'll probably be full on inventory when we leave here. Ooh, thanks taters. Oh, two Grandpa's Awesome Sauces? That's very good. And tuna fish gravy on toast? Sheesh. That's all really good stuff. Thanks, Tatey boy. Um, Let's store that stuff. All right. Let's heck and go. <laughs> I am the Lord. Makes me think of Judge Dredd. I am the law. Ooh, another college jacket. Better cold resist. Eh, we'll sell it. Press boy cap. We actually don't have anything like that on our helmet, so we can go ahead and pop that in there. Wake up, wake up. Nice. All right. Oop. Okay, a couple more waters. Oh boy, we got people converging. They're converging on my position. See crawling Joe over there till so it was almost too late. Good old crawling Joe. Jesus, what a complete and total crap. Nothing good in any of those. There we go, that's some real coffee. Let's just drink that. All right, up we go. Yeah. 
go. Alright, uh, no, take, take, and no to those. Okay. Yep. Alright, now we're in it. Jeez. This house is like all rotten flesh. cash here though which is always nice okay more, <laughs> more cash okay Not too shabby. Pretty quick in and out. Right. Triple armor pocket mod. Hello. That is a good find. Tech junkie. Powered doors and bridges. Yeah, I don't care about powered one at the moment. Open that. We're back in here? Question mark? No, we're here. Hi. We're here and they're here too. Everybody. Okay. Back in the bike. We're doing okay on inventory, so let's swing. Direction of my facing right now. Let's swing south and get that drop. Got 30 seconds left on that, uh, on that coffee. Almost there. All right. Okay, we already have that and a farm bundle. What is in the farm bundle? Okay, plots, mushroom spores. All right. Don't care about the cotton seed or the goldenrod seed, but the mushroom spores are decent. All right, back we go. All right. On the road home. We're going to buy ourselves the nail gun. What was the other thing that was really good? That was like 6K. What was that? That he had. Super don't remember. But now that we have a Grandpa's Awesome Sauce, we'll be able to sell a bunch of stuff and uh, buy it cheaply. Very good. Well, I lost Ooh, level three I AK. Thing. Here's some money. Yeah, that's worth taking. That does 
quite a bit more damage than the pipe machine gun does. Magazine size is 32. It also holds way more ammo. Nice. All right, what all are we buying? Military boots. Well, that's what. what kind of lousy customer are you anyway? Okay. Uh, modify you and put both of those onto the AK. That's very good. And you know what? We can probably put that burst mod on the pipe machine gun. Get a little bit more for it. All right. Put our stuff away. Oops. All right, we know we're selling this stuff. Good. Keep some of that ammo on us. Over money. Iron, stone, wood. Painkillers, food. Just go ahead and eat that. We have these. Keep one on us. Good. Oh, yeah, and our repair kits. Okay. Uh, and we'll put that in food. You know, we'll put these in food as well. Cool. Stuff to sell. We have a good chunk of it. Oh, almost carry all of it. All right, let's... Uh, we'll leave our food behind, and we'll take... What happened to the Grandpa's Awesome Sauce? Oh, is it in the bike? Yeah. Like one of those. And the rest we get rid of. Alright. In selling this stuff, we also might get another level. All right. Hey, be quick about your business. Okay. Um, well, real quick, I just want to make sure is there anything else we're going to want to buy. Doesn't have much. We could start buying the parts of the motorcycle. That's not a bad idea. And Lucky Looter. That's enough chit chat for me today. That's a lot of stuff we want to buy. Okay, we have 11,000. We absolutely have to buy the nail gun. The boots are a plus if we can get them. 7,200. Let's buy them. Can we still get the boots? No. That's okay. That's okay. The real win here is the nail gun. That's that good shit. I guess you're not so bad after all. All right. Uh, we have points. We have two points, so we can get to level seven. We'll need two more levels to get to eight, and then one more level to get to Daring Adventurer four. And from there, we'll start putting points into guns and stuff. Okay. 
What's up, ma'am? Excuse you. Someone there? Are you inside the trade? Are you kidding me? Get out of here. Okay. Feral Mo. Oh, we got all sorts of fools wandering around here. Much better. There's another is that spider zombie out there. Or is it a crawler? Can't tell. I think it's a spider zombie. That'll be good XP. Go take care of that. Dude. Oh my god. You're impossible to hit. There we go. Okay. This house is clear. Uh, grab the rest of this stuff. We have an extra Grandpa's Awesome Sauce. That's so good. That is so good. Um, automotive, we now have that. Um, extra food. Let's just go ahead and eat these potatoes. And then drink a tea. Good deal. Alright, um, cobblestone. We have 500. That's not terrible. Terrible. Okay. All right, there's our drawbridge. Okay. Yeah, how's this going to work? I think this would need to come down. It also might be too tall. Yeah, I think it's too tall for what we are set up right now. So, maybe that's something we can upgrade to later. But, um, for now... Oops. We'll just do cobblestone for this. That way, if we need to tear it out later, it's easier to do. Yeah, I have enough wood. All right.
This is so much better. upgraded. Nice. Only a few more levels. There we go. Yeah, I think that'll work out. I think this will work out. We have that one little space right there. We'll actually dig this out. blocks in. I mean, obviously the like the goal is for them not to want to use the bridge. But if they do come over here and they start banging on stuff, I want to make sure it's not going to collapse. Fuck! deserve this. My door is gone too. But hey, you know what? We have a drawbridge now, so we can adjust. We can adjust. Uh, I should have done like one row at a time. Damn idiot. Well, hey, here's some stone. We needed stone and sand for concrete. So... All right, we'll just uh, get all that cobble back. Replace all those blocks. Okay. Feels bad. Although, you know, I've gotten more stone, I think, than it took for all that, which is interesting. So 
So now we know when we go around and upgrade the base, we do it one block at a time. Fuck. Like right here. Do it and place a block. Just like that. There we go. Okay. And it's almost all of our wood. Okay. That's terrific. All right. Well, we know we can run up here now. Um, that put away. That sucks. Um, let's take all of that and start going on concrete. You know what? I will get a little bit of cobblestone. Couple hundred. Okay. Boy, that's a real shame. Um, so the drawbridge, I believe. We need five high, so we'd have to tear this out. We'd have to tear out our fuck hut sign and build it up higher. Which, you know what, is okay. That's okay. We'll just let it collapse. God, is it going to storm again? We had uh, some pretty crazy storms the past couple days. It's a lot of thunder and stuff. I just heard some more thunder. Okay. Take this out. Okay. some extra stone and wood back from doing this so not the worst thing in the world
Why won't it? Hmm. I need to do it from over here. Is that what I want? Placing it like in front of the block. Why is it being so weird? When you place it... See, it'll do it over here. Huh. I need to extend this. I like have no wood. I'll do it on frames if I need to. Just to get it to place, do I need to... Then I can take them out, maybe? I want it to collapse. Okay. Okay, there we go. Just had to get it to place. There we go. Okay. Welcome to the fut. <laughs> Welcome to the fut. It's all right. We'll fix it. We'll we'll have it say fuck and then hut over here, and it'll split the difference on this bad boy. This is much more substantial looking. I'll say that. See, that looks like we're serious about it. You know what I mean? Alright, let's grab some of this cobble. And a nail gun. Real quick. I'm not messing around with this. There we go. Uh, do we have enough concrete to do that in concrete real quick? Just to... Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. There we go. And maybe we just hit those for good measure. Make us feel good. There we go. That's something. It's starting to look like a real base now. God, we just need so many materials. I might have to just, like, do some material grinding off stream in this world. I don't know. We'll see. Level wise, we have one point. We're going to put. Yeah, we need two more levels, and then we can max out Daring Adventurer. We'll have to change those out to around that. And then change the railing blocks out. But that's okay. Oh, and we can activate that from really far away, too. So, if that's open, we would want to build out...
one more from that. So one more out from that. Yeah. I mean, for our purposes, this is fine. Actually, right there. Can we fall through? No, we can't actually fall. Oh, okay. If we're really trying, we can fall through. But this might even be fine just to leave as is right there. Yeah, sure. Whoop, bring it on up. And then we'll just, we'll have this kind of a pit on all sides. So the zombies come down, and that gives us ample opportunities to get some headshots as they walk up. So I think that'll help. I think we'll be in good shape if we do that. Cool. And then uh, eventually we'll make the actual hut inside this thing. I'm thinking... Uh, we have a little bit of a roof poking up, maybe a block, a little bit of a roof line, not too tall, but uh, I'm thinking like we come in the base and we go down some stairs, wrap around and then into the thing. And there's just a little bit of a, a roof that pokes out because you want to be able to see the hut but not have the hut be in the way. Because it's also good for us to have like sight lines across. Also want to do a walkway. Up top, that would be ideal. Yeah. All right, we've got some plans. I will, uh, I will be streaming more of this in the future. I think I am going to off stream do a little bit of resource gathering um, just so that way when I stream we can kind of focus on building and and going out questing and, and shooting some zombs so all right well as soon as I break these down I'll probably go ahead and call it there because I have a date with project zomboid multiplayer um, again, if you would like to play Project Zomboid with us on the server, then, uh, all you gotta do is hop in the Discord. Boom, boom, boom. So, if that interests you, then please drop on by. We'd be happy to have you. So, without further ado, thanks everybody, and I will catch you all on the next stream. I'm not even gonna do, like, a proper outro. I'm just gonna end it.